All right, so um, I got this message from uh, a student, of course, on the GMAT 41's learning platform. So she had this complaint that the video lessons she downloaded from the GMAT 41's Telegram channel, right? Uh, after some times, she came back to check and she was still asked to re-download the video. So she was worried why that is the case. All right, uh, let's just go straight. I want to explain why that happened, all right, and use this opportunity to educate you all on something that you have to do. There is a setting that you have to adjust in your Telegram so that whenever you download something, that thing will not delete after some time. The thing is, by default, Telegram has a period of time within which anything that someone downloads can remain. After that period, if you do not you kind of open that particular thing you downloaded, uh, Telegram will assume that you don't need that stuff. And to help conserve space, to save space in your device, Telegram uh, would just auto delete that stuff. They will store that thing you downloaded in their uh, cloud, in Telegram cloud, so that you can still re-download, all right? But then you can avoid that. As a matter of fact, on that platform, you can download anything and it will remain for as long as you are still in that channel. So what do you need to do so that things you download, you know, important stuff you download will not, just like that, get deleted? So there are seven steps. You are going to follow you can write those steps down possibly so that you follow up and adjust that setting now that will help you if you download any stuff whether on my channel the gmat 41's telegram channel or from any other person's channel on telegram that thing would remain for you of course you would have downloaded it because it's very important you know to you like on the GMAS 41's Telegram channel, stuff you download there are things you will still need until perhaps you are done with your semester exams. All right. As a matter of fact, as you move on to higher level, you might still need to use that. So, the first step, you would have to click on the Telegram app on your phone screen. All right. So you follow up above, I'll be display, displaying it, what you have to do. Now you have Telegram apps installed in your device. You would have to go to the screen of the device and then tap on it. So that it will open and take you to Telegram uh, space, right? So that's the first thing you do. Now, once it opens up your Telegram, you would notice three lines. The lines are horizontal. Some devices, depending on which you are using, the line could appear by the left side or maybe the right side in either case. So just tap on those three horizontal lines, okay? Then it is going to open the page for you. Once that page is open, just look through the menu that appeared. You are going to see the settings there, right? So click on that settings. Now when you tap on the settings, another page will open up, all right? You are going to see the storage and usage page. That storage and usage page is actually your first Telegram back end. Yeah, what do you mean by the back end? You can control some things from there on your Telegram. For example, if you don't want your Telegram app to auto download stuff, let's assume you just put on your data and then maybe videos, notes, pictures, and what have you, medias generally. They start downloading without you authorizing it. Sometimes the ones you don't even need might download. So to avoid that, in the first Telegram backend, you have the settings where you can, all right, uh, put off some things or to download. But that's not the focus of this video, all right? I'm targeting what you need to do to the channel. Is that clear? So that whatever you download from any channel, for example, on the GMAT 41's learning channel for students in 100 level, in 200 level, and in 300 level, the stuff will still be there for you. Okay, so uh, once you tap on that setting, like I said, it will open the first Telegram back end for you. All right, then the next thing you will do, once that first Telegram back end opens, just check through, you would see storage usage. You can see that there, storage usage. All right, so we are in step five now, take note. So you have to tap on that storage usage. 
tap on that storage usage this is going to open the telegram's second back end are you following right so it's going to open the second telegram back end for you where you can still also control some other things all right you can control some other things now in this storage usage that you tapped which opened the second telegram back end scroll down briefly scroll down briefly that will take us to step six of what you expected to do now as you scroll down briefly you are going to see stuff like auto remove cached data all right catch data media auto remove it now just below you would see the telegram's default settings you will see stuff like private chats you will see group chat you will see channels channels and of course stories each of these telegram has a default setting within which a given period if you do not make use of what you download within that period that thing will be assumed that you don't need it and telegram will help you delete it but it will store it in your cloud like i said so that you can still redownload but this is going to cost you you know because you had used data to download this stuff before coming to redownload again it's extra cost so you can prevent this from this particular step six that we are talking about where you would see that private chat group chat channels stories now if you open to that level you would see for private chat telegram had set it to never which means in normal chat with people are you following right anything that is sent to you or you sent to repress as the case might be will not be affected it will remain there telegram will not delete it for you are you following right then for the next one which is group chat anything you download from a group telegram by default allows that thing to stay for one month if you do not open to make use of that thing telegram will help you and delete it like i said it is not lost you can still redownload but you can avoid that you can avoid that if you don't want your group chat you know and media from there to be auto deleted just tap on that group if you tap you would see options all right things like weekly monthly never okay click on that never it will change that setting that default setting by telegram which is monthly for group chat to change it to never which means anything you download will remain there all right let's move on straight because my interest is that of channels stories is about two days or so it goes off now that of channels because that is what the gmats 41 uses for his classes online are you getting me right yeah so click on the channel that channel is just set to one week which means anything you download by default telegram gives just one week to that thing on channels right if you do not adjust that setting if you do not adjust it within one week you don't open that stuff telegram will just remove it for you store it in their cloud for you to redownload but then you can prevent this from happening click on that channel options will appear you see weekly monthly and never are you getting click on that word never if you click on that never what it simply means is anything you download in any channel whether you open it or not will not be deleted telegram will know that all the stops there they are important to you right so even though you don't open it they won't tamper with it they won't tamper with it because you have selected or adjusted the setting to what never so right away do this in your telegram okay adjust that setting to never so that once you download anything either from the gmats 41's learning channels on telegram for 100 200 300 level or from any other person's channel as the case might be that thing will not be lost it's only you that might decide to delete it if you don't need it anymore because as long as you are there in that channel that stuff you downloaded will remain there because that's the seventh um uh step where you adjust the channel setting to what to never and once you've done this yay right you can go ahead and mass download your video lessons your lesson notes you know these are lecture videos lesson notes on the gmat 41's learning channel on telegram these are stuff you need to be able to prepare yourself for exam i must tell you so many things related to your exam questions are really there on that channel they are there father i would like to display what a student said stuff that students should know especially those in unisic 
Are you following? When it comes to the exam question, please, you can take a look at it and read. Most of the stuff you're exposed to in terms of your exam questions, right? You have answers to them on this channel. That does not mean that I have access to your exam questions, as the case might be. I have not claimed that, and I will never claim it, right? I'm just telling you because the truth is simple. If what you are meant to learn is A, the GMAT 41 teaches you A, expands that A, go back and front, left and right, the length and depth of that thing to get you prepared so that your examiner cannot easily dribble you. And that is why, yeah, your exam questions, right? The answers are just there on that channel. You follow up with GMAT 41, you are going to enjoy your studies. And of course, you'll be ready to splash that A in your exam and with what result? First class, the only language that GMAS 41 understands. All right, let us wrap up all these steps that I've mentioned in order to adjust that setting to never so that you will not lose important stuff you've downloaded on Telegram. The first, you click the Telegram app on your phone screen. It will take you to Telegram. Next, you're going to click on the three horizontal lines that appear. Are you following? It can either be top right or left or some devices. It can be below. Okay, then this, the third step, tap on settings. Because once you tap on that three lines, it will open a menu. You see settings, tap on settings. The fourth step, tap on. After that, tap on storage and usage. Storage usage the sixth step scroll down briefly you would see some options where you have group chats you have a, a private chat you have channels you have stories okay now what you have to do click on any one of them you want to adjust to never so taking us to the seventh step the gmas 41 mixes of channels so i'm much more interested in that click on that channel select never and once you do that that's all so with these guys for all of the students that are on the GMAT 41's learning platform on Telegram online or who still wishes to register with GMAT 41, make sure you adjust this setting. Is that okay? So that once you download anything, it will remain there. And I advise you, please, use this time now and mass download ahead of your exam so that you have the video lessons, the lesson notes. As your lectures are going on, you are following up what is there. Uh, watch the video lessons take them and understand what you are being taught. Don't wait until the whole thing chokes you up. You want to watch all the video lessons in just one week or a night. It's not too good as a learning procedure. Are you following, right? Uh, download them massively. Let them be there for you so that anyone you need, any day, any time, just click on it and it pops up for you to take the video lesson. Remember, the GMATS 41 takes tutorials for 100 level students, 200 level students, 300 level students. For those in Unisic, you can also join our physical tutorials, okay? If you wish to attend a physical tutorial, just contact GMATS 41 on the number showing on the screen, right? Mm -hmm. Contact GMATS 41 to get the direction to our physical classes on campus in Unisic. So I hope you've learned something from this video, right? Do have a wonderful time.